Hey, this is Chris, Leacris Computers, Leacris Construction, Leacris whatever. I want to show you the window project I finished up here at the building I'm working at in Clarksville. Put in these new replacement windows. Everything you see is custom made. That piece of wood there, that piece of wood there, that piece of wood there. I mean, everything was cut with a saw, with a circular saw, and then planed on my planer as needed to make sure everything fits. Just barely had enough room to get those windows in there. It was like right on the money. I had to plane down the two buys about an eighth of an inch on each side to give me enough room to get in there. But I think it turns out turned out well. Got a coat of primer on everything and got two coats of exterior flat white latex, which I just think looks great. Looks great on the brick. It's a nice contrast with the wall. Here you can see one underneath the uh, overhang here. It's got the shutters. Looks looks good. I think I think it turned out well. <coughs> there's the other one. And then the last one is around the side here. This is good. You can see them in the shade and in the used uh, Pella windows. Low E, argon filled. It's supposed to be pretty energy efficient. So that's what the new window looks like. That's what the old windows look like. So you see though you got the wood sticking out beyond the plane of the wall. Water was getting in at the top, of course, because there's no flashing at all. Just that metal wrap and a, and a bead of caulk. See here, no way any water's ever gonna get in the top of those windows unless it leaks down through the roof through that cinder block header right there. So I don't think that's going to happen. Really pleased with the way this turned out. Had the only thing I didn't like was I had to put in that little spacer piece right there. But I did not. I don't have the equipment to undercut a two by to make it fit. It's just the way the block was. The block, this this sill block was not even with the block on the wall in the four inch block. So it's four inch block and then a space and then this sill, this row of sill bricks. Uh, it's concrete brick actually <clears throat> They weren't even with one another the back side of These bricks is sitting down about three-quarters of an inch lower That's where the that's where the block is on the inside actually it's a little bit higher than that And so I had a heck of a time so I had to really plane down the sill plate To get it to work and then I had to fill it in so I didn't didn't particularly like that but I think it I think it turned out okay and it's not going to be an issue with the weather especially with two coats of paint on it and a, and a coat of primer so I expect that that window will last a lot longer than that one these windows have been here about 10 years and as I showed in another video um, the sill plate on a couple of them was really rotten out so no way water's gonna get in there I think it looks good if you need your work done, give me a call, 919-482-6763. Be happy to come give you a quote. I do a lot of this kind of work. Small things, I don't build additions or anything, but you know, you got some small carpentry projects or drywall or painting. Obviously, I can do wood and paint. <laughs> Alrighty. Have any questions or comments, leave them in the section below. Like and subscribe. We appreciate when you do. We'll see you on the next video.